sorry every time. Hey, newcomer. I'm Mordrag. You should remember that name. You can buy any kind of goods from me at a cheap price. You have a problem. Really? What's that? There are people around here who want to get rid of you. Really? Then you can tell them they should send someone along to enforce their wish. What makes you so sure I'm not the one to do it? Because I think you're smarter than that boy. You'll soon realize that there are better opportunities than working for Gomez. We too need capable people in the new camp. And nobody tells you what to do. Are you really the magician's courier? What if I am? I'd like to have a chance to talk to the magicians. I have to get inside the castle. The magician's couriers bear seals, which allow them entry to the castle. If you were one of us, you could get such a seal. That's really not my problem. Tell me more about the new camp. It's the camp where you have the most freedom within the colony. We don't have any ore barons or gurus bossing us around. We have our own mind, but the ore that is produced there isn't given to the damn king. So what is it used for? Our magicians are working on a plan to break out of here. All the ore is collected for this plan. While Gomez and his people are lazing around, we drudge for freedom. That's what's going on. And if I wanted to join the new camp, could you help me? If you're serious, we can go now. I can take you to Laris. He's the head of our gang. But if you prefer to beat me out of the camp, well, go for it. I'm not listening to all the blathering anymore. Some people never learn. I wouldn't like to be in his. There was a time when things would have gone very different. You're very probably. Oh, I thought that would have been clarified a long Some time ago. Some people never learn. That's really not my. Show me your goods. Some people never learn. I'm not listening to all the blathering anymore. Some people well, never hang on. learn. I did not go rushing into anything. It Let's talk about something else instead. I doubt that's ever likely to change. I thought that had been cleared up ages ago. People always talk. Some about people it. never oh. learn. People that always won't talk. Again. Maybe. I wouldn't like to be in his shoes, though. Same old story every time. That won't happen again. That's Don't not really my us, problem. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're very probably some people never. There must be something about that story after all. Let's talk about something. Uh... Let's go to the new camp. Okay, follow me.
Well, here we are. When you pass through the gate, you'll reach the new camp. Talk to Lars. He will help you. Give this to him. It's a precious ring. It's your ticket to see Lars. You need a good reason to be allowed to meet him. Well, thinking about it, I think I'll stay here for some time. I've earned enough for now, and things are heating up in the old camp. If you want, come and meet me at the bar. It's the hut out on the lake. Take care. See you. It was obvious that there would be trouble ahead. Maybe. Hi, I'm new here. You're very so what? Right. What are you doing? Again. What's it look like? Relax I'm smoking. <laughs> if you think I'll let you have a drag, forget it. Aren't you going to try and stop me? Ask me what or something. Nah, that's too much trouble for me. Besides, someone like you won't do much damage in there. Wasn't very clever. You shouldn't believe everything you hear. What's it like inside? Like always. <laughs> Calm, just a couple of brawls. There was a time when things would have gone as very as not involved. Same old story every time. Hey, just arrived. We need somebody to take some water to the peasants in the rice fields. This way you can make friends with a few people. What do you think? Sure, I'll be glad to help. Great. Go to the rice lord. He'll give you the water and tell you everything you need to know. You take care of the rice fields, don't you? Why? You looking for work? Lefty sent me. Oh yeah? What did he say? I'm to bring the peasants some water. Right. Here's a dozen bottles of water. There's about twice that amount of peasants. So make sure you share it out evenly. Lefty sent me. I've brought you some water. Thanks, boy. I needed that. Lefty sent me. I've brought you some water. Thanks, man. A bit longer and I'd have started drinking mud. What are you doing here? You looking for trouble? Hey, relax. I'm a newcomer. Huh? You look okay, though. You never know. You get new guys come along thinking they're it every day. What's a man like you doing with the peasants? Lee asked me that. I don't fight anymore, except to defend myself. I killed a guy once. And that was once too many. That's why they chucked me in this goddamn colony. It was justice. How did it happen? It was just an ordinary bar fight. I didn't mean to kill the guy. I just must have hit him too hard. I was a blacksmith at the time. I didn't know my own strength. Why did you join this camp? I'll tell you. My only option was to join those cyclonies, and I didn't want to let those gurus of theirs mess about with my brain. In the old camp, I'd have had too much trouble with the guards, but the mercenaries and rogues do have some respect. They're afraid of you? Maybe. Anyway, I found peace here, and you should try the same. Can you teach me to be as strong as you are? Even if I could, what would you use your strength for?
Self-defense. That takes speed, not strength. Do you think cracking skulls is better than finding peace? To teach these bastards how to talk to me properly. And before you knew it, you'd become another of those bastards yourself. No, sir, I'm not training you for that. Lefty sent me. I've brought you some water. Thanks, man. I was just about to start drinking the mud. Lefty sent me. I've brought you some water. Thanks, boy. I needed that. Lefty sent me. I've brought you some water. Thanks, man. A bit longer and I'd have started drinking mud. Lefty sent me. I've brought you some water. Thanks, boy. I needed that. Lefty sent me. I brought you some water. Thanks, man. My mouth's like a desert. Lefty sent me. I brought you some water. Thanks, man. A bit longer and I'd have started drinking mud. Lefty sent me. I brought you some water. Thanks, man. My mouth's like a desert. Lefty sent me. I brought you some water. Thanks, man. A bit longer and I'd have started drinking mud. Lefty sent me. I brought you some water. Thanks, man. A bit longer and I'd have started drinking mud. Lefty sent me. I brought you some water. Thanks, boy. I needed that. Hey, you! Well done! You're useful for something after all. I think this is exactly the right task for you. From now on, you do it every day. Go on with it right now. What are you doing here? I'm working for the Rice Lord. If you need something, ask Lefty.
Do you intend to go through this gate? Do you intend to stop me? No, but you should know what's waiting for you. This is not like in the old camp, and not like being with the sect loonies either. And what am I expecting here? There are no guards or Templars to look after you. It's every man for himself. The only ones who stick together are us mercenaries. What do the mercenaries do? We, we are the mercenaries of the Water Mages. Our target is to break free from here. We're working hard for it, and don't plan to take things easy like the guys from the old camp who are just having an easy time resting on the backs of the diggers. And we all follow Lee. He's a great man. He's the one who holds this damn camp together. What do the mages do? They investigate the magic characteristics of the ore our scrapers collect in the mine. As far as I know, they want to blow the whole damn ore mound sky high to free us from the barrier. Sounds dangerous. They said we shouldn't worry. You have a massive ore mound here? You could say that. We could buy the king's wife for that. But we don't give a damn about trading the ore with that old fart. We want to get out of here. Where's the ore mound? You want to see a real mound of ore, do you? There's a hole in the middle of the cave. They shove it all in there. But you won't get anywhere near it, I can tell you. The mages and our people guard the ore day and night. I was just curious. What about the rest of the people? All crooks. They don't give a damn about the camp. I'd rather just have the peasants guarding the front gate. How are things going at the moment? The scrapers are still collecting. Once they have enough ore, we'll blow the mound up. Watch your back. Are you looking for something? I'm looking for leaks in the dam. I reckon there's a lurker gnawing at the foundations. The beast grinds its teeth and claws against the stones and wooden beams underwater. If it carries on, the whole dam will soon be undermined. Is there anything I can do to help? Sure, stop that beast from gnawing at my dam. Where can I find the beast? I'd hunt round on the other side of the lake. Nobody ever goes there. That's probably where its den is. Did you build the dam? Yes, I built the dam back when we founded the new camp. Of course everyone helped, but I was the master builder.